if you notice this fly buzzing around my face, I'm just gonna have to work with it. Ditto on the copious amounts of sweat coming off of my body. I hope you enjoy. Oh, this new crazy mother. I thought I was gonna be done with my Why I Don't series, but I've been getting this question so often for the last few years that I figured I'd make one more video for now, and who knows, maybe there'll be more future videos. But this video, gosh, there's a fly all around my head and my face. Okay, uh, this video is going to be about why I don't wear sunscreen. I know a lot of people have differing opinions around sunblock and their personal preferences, and I wholeheartedly encourage everybody to feel out what your preferences are there and to follow what feels best for you. I'm gonna share with you my experience and what feels best for me and why I do it this way. I grew up in Rhode Island. I was actually born on Block Island where beaches are a big thing as you can imagine being that it is an island. And so in the summers I spent so much time outside playing in the sun lathered in sunblock and clothing because I have really fair skin and what I found was after a certain amount of time in the sun it did not matter how much sunblock I had on I was gonna get burnt. So <clears throat> my childhood included a lot of sunblock and I just figured that that was the only way you know that I'm fair skinned I have Irish English background and that I needed to do that to protect to protect myself from the sun. So it came as such a shock to me when I switched my diet about four years ago and found that I no longer got burnt when I was in the sun. It was wild, really. It, it blew my mind and I found that I could actually tan a little bit. So what I've been doing for the last four years is enjoying as much time as feels good in my body to be out in the sun and then heading to the shade when I feel warm and it's naturally taking care of my sun intake. I don't get burnt. I feel really good. I get great vitamin D. I get some freckles when it's warm. The awesomest part about this is that all I have to do is check in with myself and with my body and see what's feeling good for me and my skin naturally takes care of itself from there. I never enjoyed putting sunblock on. I, I don't like to put things on my skin in general. I like to be very aware of what I am ingesting and taking into my body and I love not wearing lotions or creams including sunscreen. I love that I can seek out the shade when I am feeling too warm. At different times I've played around with like using a hat if I'm biking and that's been helpful too. If I did for some reason want to be out in the sun for a really long time I would probably put something on like a shirt on to cover up my shoulders so they didn't get burnt but I've spent a good amount of time out in the sun especially like at different festivals I've attended in warm climates or in the summer doing exercise classes for long periods of time and things like that and my skin has been so taken care of. I also know that because I tend to be in warm climates year round, I have this base tan that's always like built up so I'm not going from, you know, really white skin to all of a sudden tropical sun and, and getting a burn, which is super helpful. Gosh, I'm sure you guys will have all sorts of questions so maybe I'll do a follow up or something like that. but. Really, this is pretty simple for me. This is why I don't wear sunblock. It feels amazing for me. If you want to hear more about how I've transitioned my diet to eating raw fruits and leafy greens, you can check out this video. And yeah, I think that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys again later. Bye.